OpenAI is doubling down on Codex and Codex is very confusing and in this video I'm going to break it down for you to understand what is OpenAI Codex. In simple language OpenAI figured out that Claude code is becoming extremely popular and they have to do something and that is what Codex is all about. Now Codex comes in different forms and OpenAI has got a major update for Codex. So first of all Codex has got a new if you're using Visual Studio Code then you can run Codex within your Visual Studio Code whether it is Visual Studio Code, Cursor or whatever you are using but if it is a VS Code fork then you can use Codex as an extension within that and the best part here is that everything that you want to do about Codex is also included in your ChatGPT plan. So if you are a plus subscriber, if you are a team subscriber if you're an enterprise subscriber then your existing chat gpt plan can give you codex access you don't have to have apa or you don't have to burn your apa credits so first thing codex within visual studio code or any other visual studio code fork the second thing is now codex is also available in cloud and OpenAI has got the same name for everything so codex is a plugin codex is cloud codex is a, a cli command level interface and now OpenAI has made it easier for you to have a good handoff so what you do on your ide can be handed off to the cloud so for example you're doing something work in your ide and then you suddenly want to leave your office and travel somewhere maybe you don't have internet so you can easily delegate that to the cloud and then access it even with your phone then codex continues the task from codex web and instead of doing it locally without losing the context you can just do it from the cloud this has been one of the most requested features from users because they want to complete the task but without having to lose the context whatever they were doing and now it is possible with codex the final thing that they've done is they have launched a new PR review bot. So if you are using GitHub and then you have got a PR or you're maintaining an open source library or you're part of an organization that already uses the Codex review bot. So now what you can do is use this bot to review PRs and this is one of the most critical tasks in the software engineering life cycle and now Codex can do that. All you have to do is go tag Codex and then ask Codex to review the job and then Codex will go review to understand what kind of changes have been done and if, if, if you know the dependency is fine or just like all sort of things it's going to validate whatever changes has been done and it is going to approve the PR. So this auto review or tagging Codex and review is the third thing that OpenAI has announced today along with a new improvement in Codex CLI. In a nutshell, now Codex is a Visual Studio Code extension, Codex is a cloud environment, Codex is a GitHub bot, and mainly Codex is a CLI, command level interface, just like your Cloud Code and Gemini CLI. All of this included within your ChatGPT plan. So all you have to do is log in with your ChatGPT plan and start automating your code. Let me know what you think about Codex CLI. Generally, if you're a Cloud Code fan, I think there is a shift in the sentiment in the last couple of weeks. And let me know what you think about this. See you on the video. Happy prompting.